the long-awaited update 5.8 for World of Tanks Blitz is just around the corner. It brings numerous changes. Dynamic lighting was improved on the Faust map. Before it was lit by just the moon, we installed more powerful lamps in the spotlights, and now the lighting looks more realistic in different parts of the map. We also reworked the lighting in the rocket hangar. Just look at the flashlight flare on the back of the vehicle. The radio now transmits in FM, and the rocket lifting off in the beginning now belongs to a different nation. Let's talk vehicles. A branch of Chinese tank destroyers was added to the game. Five vehicles of tiers 6 to 10. The first new vehicle is the WZ-131G FT. This agile tank destroyer can defeat any tier 6 enemy. It can always be where it's needed most. At tier 7, there's the T-34 2G FT. A mobile tank destroyer with good damage per shot and a quick reload time. It has a similar playstyle to the E-25. Get into position first, take a shot, reload, shoot again. Its small size and good concealment are perfect qualities for a predator. The WZ-111-1G is at Tier 8. The good penetration rate and damage per shot help you confidently and reliably destroy enemy vehicles. It's better to keep your distance in battle, though. The WZ-111GFT carries on this trend at Tier 9. This vehicle performs best when it's a considerable distance from the enemy. The gun can penetrate any vehicle of Tiers 9 and 10. A great option for those who want to cause consistent damage. And at the top of the tree is the WZ-113GFT. The Chinese Tier 10 vehicle has exactly what you want in a TD. High damage per shot. Each shot is satisfying. The solid cabin armor deflects enemy shells. Just make sure you don't flash your lower armor glassy. And its speed and maneuverability let you use a number of cunning tactics. The update brings two new legendary camouflages to the game. Origin for the T-54 first prototype and Soviet Tier 8 premium vehicle. And Wild for the Leopard 1, a German Tier 10 vehicle. When a real predator goes hunting, everyone in the vicinity trembles. Football enthusiasts will like the rare war paints for any vehicle. Ol' Senora, Galacticos and Ole Ole Ole. The already familiar Verdun Forest and Nine Lives will be resupplied for free in Update 5.8. And one more thing. Certificates for free XP can now be combined. Ten common certificates can be combined into one rare. Ten rare ones into one epic. And ten epic ones into one legendary. The latter will give you 350,000 free experience per use. You can find the full changelog in the game client. Subscribe to our channel and good luck on the battlefield! Hey, there's something about mad games here. Are we recording this as well?